Hello guys, it is uh, me DSW, um, I'll be playing more of this game, probably sound like really weird and awkward, because I'm not used to this, but hopefully I'll get used to this man, it's pretty weird, talking, then I watch these videos and I'm like, oh, I sound so weird, horrible, wait a minute, Guy. Thought he was gonna give me a watermelon. Man, that sucks. Uh, but yeah. Um,. There's this boo thing going on right now. So I'll probably go do that right now. Probably gonna cut this part up. So I'll see you when I get there. Okay, I'm here. Uh, you have to go to Supreme Kai tap him and stuff and he says this <laughs> well oh no no I got absorbed guys hopefully somebody frees me before I die But, uh, yeah, I guess I'm gonna tell you guys, like, a story. Um, <laughs> it's a pretty long story, though, about how I got into Dragon Ball. And, uh, I have some friends who don't like Dragon Ball, and it kinda hurts me. You know, it's messed up. Oh no, I died. Well, yeah, it's like messed up. Because they're like my friends and stuff, and I don't want them to uh, be that way. So yeah, it hurts me. But uh, I deal with it. I can accept that I have friends that don't like Dragon Ball Z. Well, yeah. So I'll tell you how I got, how I got into Dragon Ball Z. So like when I'm when I was like three, we used to have this game, and we would like, you know, play it. It was Dragon Ball Z Budokai One. I, I know that now, but at first I didn't even know the name of it. So yeah, I would play. Me and my brother would play this game like a lot, and then like two thousand in like two thousand eight, we uh. Sorry, I'm trying to focus. We like. No, I. I was watching Nick one day, and I saw these characters that I recognized from the game. I was like, whoa! I mean, the character I recognized, of course, like, the character I recognized first was Pickle, because his design is like. You can, like, tell that that's Pickle. But yeah. I watched it, I missed like the first few episodes, yeah I watched it, and it was pretty cool, and by first grade, I was all like, Kaioken, at school, now I'm thinking back to it, uh, I'm kind of embarrassed at myself for doing those weird things, I used to run like Goku did, um, when he was running on Snake Way, to get to his friends, save them um yeah a lot of people don't really like Dragon Ball Z Kai but if it wasn't for Dragon Ball Z Kai probably wouldn't have uh, even known about the show about the show Dragon Ball Z so yeah you know I played I played more games my cousin had this game Dragon Ball Super Dragon Ball Z 
That was like my first Dragon Ball Z game that I remembered. Um, and yes, I got into other games too. Other Dragon Ball Z games too. That was pretty cool. Well, anyway, when I was, when I was playing, yeah, when, when I had Dragon, Super Dragon Ball Z, um, I remember this guy I knew, a uh, friend, I'm not going to tell his name because that's pretty messed up, but yeah, he was my friend, and like, I traded him, traded with him, I gave him Super Dragon Ball Z for Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3. Um, I had never played Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3. And when he gave it to me, I was all excited. I put the game in my PlayStation 2. Put the game in my PlayStation 2. And then, like, I started it up. And the game was broken. You don't even, you probably don't even know the disappointment and sadness and rage I felt when I saw that the game didn't work. So the next day I was like, hey, can you give me my game back? And he said that he had lost it. And uh, <laughs> I felt even more rage and sadness. But I eventually, I eventually got the game back, so that's cool. And I also eventually got Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3 because of my grandfather. He's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, he, he bought me it, and he brought it to my house. And then <laughs> I felt more feelings, the good feelings. Uh, the feeling I felt, the feelings I felt when I started the game up. And I saw the intro for the first time. It was pretty cool. Yeah, I played through the game. And then I stopped at Android 18. The fight with Super Saiyan Vegeta versus Android 18. Because I couldn't get past that fight. Because I was like 8 at the time. Um, yeah. Then I put it on easy. And then I... Then once I beat that part of the game. Uh... Once I beat that part of the game, I got to the Bruce Saga, and I saw Majin Vegeta for the first time. It was really cool. <laughs> and, yeah, I got, I found more games through it, too. I mean, I played more Dragon Ball Z games and stuff. Um, and, oh yeah, like, how I got into Naruto, and how I got into Dragon Ball Z, kind of linked. So, I guess enough of my horrible talking <laughs> because of my awkwardness. And I'm going to try to beat Majin Buu. Probably get some god armor. That'd be pretty awesome. Yeah. No! I got absorbed again. I don't want to use all my stones, so if I die, I'm probably not going to be playing on this anymore. So I guess I'll see you guys later.